Hello and welcome to another video on the Ultimate Ebook Creator. Now you're going to absolutely love this brand new feature that I've added into the application and that is to create fixed layout ebooks using images. So on the left hand side I have my Ultimate Ebook Creator already open and on the right hand side here is my folder with all my images. So all we need to do is go to File then import manuscript and then image pages and over here we're going to select this folder so we'll click on the browse we'll go down to um, the UEC demo and then converted pages okay so we have 15 uh, JPEG files and and this import only accepts JPEG files and that's because this is the best format for Kindle. So make sure that all your images are in JPEG format. Okay. Here we have four options. The first one is that um, all the images will be put into one chapter, which is created just under the contents. This is probably not what you want to do, but some customers actually prefer that. The second option is to name each chapter that is created depending on the file name of the image. So in this example, we're going to create 15 chapters and each one will be named page six, page seven, etc. Yep. And then the third option is auto uh, chapter name. So for example, if I put something like page as the prefix, and I click on import then we're going to get 15 chapters and they will be named page one two three etc okay and the last option is to manually enter all your chapter names and the number of names that you enter in here so you enter the name like this and then press the enter so one one chapter name per line um, and then you can say page two page three etc um, and here we see the count of how many uh, pages we've already defined, but um, it's got to match 15. Anyway, we won't be doing this. For this demo, I'm gonna select the easiest and quickest option, which is chapter name taken from image file name. Once I've selected this, um, keep an eye on the content here and then this area here, and you'll see the magic happen, okay? So let's click on import and see how this works. So you can see here that all my chapters got created. I'll click on OK. And you can see here that we have all our chapters with the um, image per uh, per chapter. OK, so you can see that we have uh, images and pages and that's it. Now, the next thing to do is fill out the book information. So I'm just going to type in. You can put whatever you want, just very quick. Um, and then we're going to go to export and then generate Kindle Mobi. And um, in here, I'm just going to type in animals. Okay. And then click save. Okay. Once it's done, we see uh, we can open the file location. All right. And here is our, our Mobi file. Now we just need to open up the Kindle previewer. Now this preview previewer is a free software from Amazon and you can download uh, from the Amazon website and I highly recommend that you use this to test all your ebooks because you can actually test you know you can simulate different devices different page orientation and you can see how the font and the file font and the size of the font will affect your um, uh, your ebook yeah so um, yeah so please download this to test your ebooks now here is our movie file. We simply drag it onto the surface of the Kindle uh, Previewer and it will take a few seconds to um, uh, convert. All right, so once it's converted, you can see here all our uh, pages and you can click on a page and you can actually see the page or you can use these left and right arrow buttons to navigate your pages. But you can see that the book is there and here is our a table of contents I can click on any page and it will take me to that particular page so I'll go back here I'll say page 8 
and then we can go to the page. All right, so that was the demo. It's really, uh, I think this feature is something that my wife actually wanted and um, she was a little bit um, frustrated with just, you know, copying and pasting the images one at a time. So I provided a quick feature for her to quickly create these um, fixed layout books. All right, I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, we'll see you in the next one.